Welcome back. Well, nothing but sunshine and clear skies up through about Friday. That's when things take a big, big change. Let's show you now what we've got cooking. HD Doppler not showing a whole lot of activity. Little cloud cover moving into western Colorado. That will spill into eastern Colorado as the day progresses, but really it's going to clear rather quickly. The big system we're tracking right now off of the northeastern, or excuse me, the northwestern coast up off of the North Pacific there. This little area of low pressure that we're looking up at at the South Pacific coast, that's hooking on to lots of moisture and just dragging that right up on top of the states. And that's going to continue to move into our area over the next few days. Here's how things are going to play out. So that area of low pressure hooking on to that moisture. That moisture is actually called the Pineapple Express. That's the official term of it, all right? As that system continues to move in, we're going to see another little area of low pressure develop. That's just going to pull more moisture our way. Also, a little batch of cooler air with it. So about 3, p uh, 3 a.m., I should say Thursday, that's when that system's really going to start maturing off of the Pacific coast, making inland right about Thursday morning or so. We're not talking a whole lot about Colorado weather because we're looking relatively nice up through Friday, but this system is headed our way and likely going to impact the area Saturday night into Sunday with a pretty decent amount of snowfall. As for lows tonight with those clear skies, we're looking a little bit brisk out there, about 28 degrees here into the springs, 21 into Pueblo, and looking at the low to mid 20s out into eastern Colorado and a few single digits into the mountains tonight. As for tomorrow, warming up to the 60s, 64 degrees into Pueblo, 60 here into the springs, and a few low 60s as we check out eastern Colorado, 50s and 40s up into the high terrain. As for the next seven days, here's how things play out for us. Again, rather nice up through Friday, plenty of sunshine, but Saturday night, that's when things really set in. Now, Saturday will start out very similar to what we've been seeing all week. It's going to be late Saturday afternoon into the evening that this rain mixed with snow starts to set into the region. Same story for Pueblo, warming up to 68 degrees on Friday. That's not a typo, I promise. And we're looking at about 42 once that system starts setting in. Plenty of snow on Sunday again. Sunday right now looks to be the snowiest. Now, forecast models have still had a little trouble anticipating just how much snowfall, and a lot of it's going to depend all where that area of low pressure lands. But one thing is for sure, definitely going to see some snowfall Saturday night into Sunday, lingering into the mountains into Monday morning. So starting to feel a little bit more Christmassy around the state once this weekend rolls around. Well, you know, uh Christmas isn't that far off. No. <laughs> and a lot of folks would enjoy it like exactly. Christmas. Exactly. Yeah. So we'll see. Might stick around. Uh, thanks, Jason. Yep, not a problem.